we gotta add loot for these chests. Dude, there's gonna be 50 guns. I'm not hard coding all 50 guns in this list. Literally, this registry only exists for chests. That actually improves my life so much more. We're gonna call this loot pool registry. We also need max stack size. What's the max stack size for band-aids? 15, right? We've set up the list that we need. 17.6 for drop chance. Floor weight, 3.25. Floor quantity, 10. Phenomenal. Data has been applied. So now we should see a band-aid on the ground. There it is. I mean, the model's not there because I haven't pushed it for my Windows OS. Now we gotta fix the picking up thing because it breaks every time we pick it up. Boom! We got it. We have it in our inventory. So now we loop through each gun category. Each gun category has its own chance. We'll put on our item rarity and we'll say gun chance. Drop chance. Shotguns. 22. Rifle. 43. Bam! SMG. 14. Sniper. 10. Pistol. 11. And RPGs. 5. Maybe we should consider doing weighted randoms because this naive wild logic does kind of stink. And we'll call this potential guns data. And we'll go gun loot is equal to potential gun data dot create item with that rarity there we go i'm amazed by what garbage this old code was that doesn't even make sense i guess i'll just run a while oh shit is there an infinite while loop there's an infinite while loop all right let's give it a shot chest placed down maybe means loot is correctly set oh and it's a green assault rifle oh it works it works oh my god oh my god yes let's run a slash test again okay it's a green again i wonder if it's ever gonna return a different color okay so it's green again Okay, so I think it's fucked. It's still infinitely looping. The problem isn't that the chance isn't firing. The problem is there's no gun to loop through. The list is empty. The four is looping through an empty list in the wild. I'm cuckoo. Next time, we gotta add props, which is breaking props. We gotta add the lobby. We gotta add the storm. We gotta add the battle bus. I'm excited.